So here's how to modify, actually very easily modify, I don't know if I'd even call it modifying, but increase the performance of your Cyclone 3000 watt kit. Uh, if you have the stock controller, there are a bunch of wires that are left unused. Uh, I don't even know what half them are, but uh, there's one that says three speed. I think it's for a controller's you have Sorry, out of frame there. It's for the controller, a little switch. You can have three different speed settings if you plug it into there. Uh, if you take a jumper and jump the pink and the black one together, I just bent a little, took a little piece of paper clip right here, and you can see. I just took a little piece of paper clip and bent it over. And you stick it. It's kind of hard to do with one hand here. Stick it right in there and jump those two wires. Once again, that's the pink and the black one on the plug that says three speed. Uh, what this does, I found it uh, lets the motor max out RPMs, uh, increasing in a higher top speed. So yeah. I'm not sure if it creates more power off the line, but it, it definitely revs up a lot higher. Jump those two wires. And the uh, motor gets a little warmer. Uh, doesn't damage anything. I've been running it like this for a couple months now. I uh, never had any problems. Uh, the only thing that happens is like going up a hill, the motor will just get a little warm, but it never overheats. So, yeah, that's how to hack your cyclone controller. Alright, thanks guys. Bye bye.